Right now, first up at five o'clock, a longtime Rockville high school teacher and golf coach under arrest for child pornography and voyeurism. Police say some of the victims were students and 52 year old Christian Stevenson has since resigned from his position. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Courtney Zeller is joining us live from the Vernon Police Department with some brand new details and Courtney, this is just so disturbing. Well, it is, and we talked to the superintendent moments ago. We are told Stevenson was a teacher in Vernon for the past 22 years. Once that arrest warrant was issued last month, that's when he resigned from his teaching and coaching roles at Rockville High School. A well-liked social studies teacher and varsity golf coach at Rockville High School. Now 52-year-old Christian Stevenson is facing some serious charges. The case began when the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children received a report that child pornography was uploaded to an email address, which police say belonged to Stevenson. Investigators found hundreds of images of children, but identified more than 40 images that are considered child porn. During the investigation, detectives came across some local images of high school students. Ended up doing a search warrant back in uh, September where we were able to locate other voyeuristic images um, that, that occurred um, that were used on uh, cell phones and uh, other personal devices of, of this, this gentleman. Any work-related devices? Uh, unknown at this time. Okay. Police say they found images on Stevenson's cell phone, iPad, and laptop. According to the arrest warrant, many of the photographs appear to have been taken inside Rockville High School, specifically in Stevenson's classroom, various hallways, and the library. The focus of many of the photographs were the buttocks, chest, or private areas of young female students. Some photographs, recordings, appear to have been taken while Stevenson was sitting at a desk others while walking behind students in a hallway. Police tell us some of the dozens of photos taken were of two female students, one just 15 and 17 years old at the time. The warrant also says none of the students appeared to have any idea they were being photographed or recorded. Vernon School Superintendent says this, the safety and well-being of our students and staff is our top priority. Vernon Public Schools expects all staff to strictly adhere to the district's high standards of professional conduct and code of ethics. I know he was well liked and that's kind of what I think is the, uh, the detrimental portion of this right now. And Stevenson was expected in court today. Instead, we're learning he was arraigned in a room at Hartford Hospital. His bond set at $75,000. We're live from Vernon. Courtney Zeller, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.